Hello friends, myself Amar. Now in this video, I will discuss another menu in prime cases, which is called as the panel menu. Okay, let me show you the output first. This is a panel man menu. Okay, these are called as that is with Ajax, without Ajax, and courses. These are called as sub menu. Okay, and once I click on this sub menu, then the items within these sub menus are called as menu items okay now how to create this panel man menu this portion i will discuss today okay let me move to the code now here what i have done as usual i have created a project named as panel menu and inside that i have index.html page okay and after that we have h colon form tag the rest of the code these things i am not discussing because these things are already known to you if you are following my videos right now inside the form tag i have used growl inside the growl i have used p colon auto update right to create the panel menu we need to use the panel menu tag and in the style i have specified the width of the panel menu as 300 pixels okay now inside the panel menu as i told you these are called as sub menu okay to create the sub menu we need to use a tag which is called as the sub menu right and the label of the sub menu i have given as with ajax that's why this label is visible here with ajax right now once i click here then two items are visible file and edit this means inside this sub menu there are two menu items and to create these two menu items inside this sub menu we need to use the menu item tag and in the value i have specified file and for the second one i have specified the value as edit right and for this first menu item in the action i have written mb.file and for the second menu item in the action i have written mb.edit now as you can guess mb is nothing but the name of the managed bean and the file is nothing but a function and edit is also a function which is present inside the managed bin what this action attribute will do this will decide what will happen whenever i will click on this file what will happen whenever i will click on this edit this means whenever i will click on this file then what will happen the file function of the managed bin will be called right now similarly i have created another sub menu named as without ajax and as you can see inside without ajax there is only one menu item named as view right view in the action i have written mb.view this means whenever i will click on this view then which method will be called of the managed bin view method will be called and in the ajax i have written false now if you are not writing it then by default the value of ajax will be true now what is the difference of making ajax as true and false this portion i will discuss later on right now for the third sub menu as you can see for the third sub menu the caption is courses that's why for the third sub menu the label is courses and if you click on courses then there is another sub menu which is called as the ripples code and that's why inside this sub menu i have created another sub menu labeled as ripples code okay now if you click on ripples code then you can see there is another sub menu named as tutorials that's why inside this sub menu you can see another sub menu is there labeled as tutorials right and inside this tutorials there are four menu items and to create the menu items i have used this menu item tag right Uh, uh, the value as home, uh, the value as JSF, Prime Faces, Java FX, and in the URL I have specified the corresponding YouTube uh, channels link. Right? This means whenever I will click here, click here, click here, or here, it will open the corresponding playlist of the Java FX tutorial, Prime Faces tutorial, JSF tutorial, or the uh, channel link for Ripple's code. Right? This is how we can create. the panel menu right now let me show you what i have done in the bean model as you can see i have created a class named as bean model and i have decorated it as managed bean by using the managed bean attribute and the name i have given as mb 
now here i have created some functions named as file edit and view whenever i will click on file then this add message will be called and here i have passed two parameters file and file clicked similarly for edit i have passed edit and edit clicked for view i have passed view and view click and what this add message function is doing this add message method is producing the message by using the faces message class these things i have discussed in my gsf tutorial right now let me show you here if you can see for the first menu item this means this one if i click on file then what is happening what action will be happening the file method of the managed bin will be called this means this file method will be called okay and what this will do it will print the message as a growl let me show you once you click here then you can see this file is displayed now if you are wondering why this file is displayed why this file clicked is not displaying then let me show you in the growl if you remember we have a property which is called as so detail if you are making it as true then let me refresh this once again now if you click on file then you can see file and file clicked both the messages are coming now if you remember i told you if you are not using the ajax attribute then by default it will be true that's why once you click here then there is no refreshment of the page the page is not getting refreshed right but for this option that is for view i have made the ajax value as false now if you click here then you can see the page is getting refreshed and after that we are getting this message right and uh, similarly if you are clicking on home gsf prime faces in java fx then the corresponding link will be called okay this is how we can create the panel menu in prime faces and this is the entire code just have a look this is the entire code for the index.xhtml okay this is the code for the index.xhtml and this is the code for the managed bin which i have created this simple as it is okay i hope you have liked my video if you like my video please subscribe my channel like my channel and please share my channel thank you so much